Well, Tony Braxton's life is the stuff movies are made of, and now it really is, <laughs> in the new TV movie, Unbreak My Heart. Yeah, the film follows her public divorce, her family struggles, and how this seven-time Grammy winner, who has sold over 67 million records, rose to the top. Take a look. Calm down. The enemy is trying to break up our family. I don't have to take it. Okay? I'll call him right now and tell him it's all of us or none of it. No. Tracy. Give your sister the phone. Mommy. This is the chance of a lifetime. Tony has to take it. And Tony is here with us now. Oh my God, you almost turned down the opportunity oh to have goodness. a record deal. I'm so did. glad you did. <laughs> I know. This movie, I'm telling you, uh, we had an opportunity to watch it and we absolutely Thank loved it because for fans out there, we know your story on uh, yeah. bits and pieces. You know, you wrote a book about it, yeah. there's a reality show, but this goes so much deeper. Yes, it and does. And you're executive producing executive this. Executive producer. They work hard for the money. Who yeah. knew? Oh my God. It was, you know, it was really tough for me because it was hard to be objective because it's a movie yes. about myself and yeah. how do I be fair you know and what I found by doing this movie is very therapeutic for me yeah. and you're always talking about people who have hurt you and done harm to you yeah. while watching it I saw things that I've done to other people to hurt them Ooh. oh wow I have to check myself and apologize to them. What yes. a process yes, for you. Yes, it's been a process, but therapeutic, thank God. That's yeah. good. Yeah. yeah, so what was it, I'm just wondering, because your whole family is in this movie as well, so <laughs> what was the casting like? Because you executive proof, so did you cast yes. all your sisters? And you know, with myself and my sisters, I said, just give me the last, the bottom three. Yeah. Whatever you guys think. And okay. so the casting agent, who is actually Leah, um, from Empire, who did okay. that his sister. Yeah, oh, his yeah, sister. she's great. So, yes, okay, Tony. So they gave me the girls, and when I saw Lexi, they said, we think this is you. I said, well, let me see. You know, I'm <laughs> she was perfect. She is so me. She stands like me. She holds a head like me. Yeah, she yeah. looks like you. Naturally. Yes, yeah. she, she, was she was really wonderful. good. And my sisters were a bit easier, even though they gave me a list. I said, just find the personalities. And my sister Tamar is probably the easiest one. <laughs> I mean, it was a cattle call of yeah. hundreds of thousands of girls wanting to be Tamar, you know, which was great. So she, dot she, com, dot you com. Know, that's dot com, that's what they said. And they would just, <laughs> She's like, I don't do that. I'm like, let me tell you, yes, you do. That was great. Was so were your sisters out of the process completely? Because I would imagine, and your mom and your dad, yeah. I would imagine they would want to say, okay, who's going to play me? Yeah. You know, my sister Tawanda was one of the associate producers, so she was active in helping with that because she knew it was too close for me to do yeah. some of that part. Yeah. yeah. And the actor who plays uh, Babyface. Oh, Miguel Van looks like Babyface. Just, he and his baby. energy. He does. Oh, my gosh. It's amazing when you see actors, you go, oh, my God, they're so talented. They can just meet a person and become yes. them. Yeah. And Debbie Morgan was wonderful yes. playing my mom. She yeah. just brought this energy. Like she was very angry some things with my dad. She portraying my mom. Yeah. And my mom said she was my, my dad had infidelity issues. Yeah. And she said she's gonna cut it off. And Debbie Morgan said it, it was the way she said it. She was my mom, I'm gonna cut it off. Yeah. So those are actual words actual that your parents words, spoke. Actual things <laughs> oh that happened. Yes. Oh boy. It's very compelling but beautiful. I'm yeah. proud. I'm very proud. Well and I, I love all obviously all the songs in this movie too, and you re recorded all of them. So this is actually your voice yes. through the whole thing. Yes, it was a little hard because I had to sing like I did when I was twenty. That's yeah. what I was gonna say. The voice was a little higher then, you know, before the babies and stuff. But <laughs> it came across really great and Lexi did a really good job of, of just embracing the energy of how I perform. Yeah. Now, has your family seen this movie yet? Oh, my whole family's seen it, except for Tamar. <gasps> Tamar's the only one, but Tamar, she's working. It seems like she's going to be the most working. vocal about it. Well, she told us about, you know, I need to make sure this girl is me, but she met her. She met her and said she's great. She's wonderful. Okay, so everybody's happy. Everyone's happy. Because everyone's you go happy. there in this movie. I yes. do. I'm being honest and vulnerable. I think it's important when you're telling stories to tell your story without telling others, which yeah. is very, really hard. That's hard, yeah. But I wanted to be honest. I couldn't just say... I had to say that let people see the things that I had done as well that yeah. weren't so good too. Yeah, um, that's nice. It, it's to really that. well done. We love it. <laughs> Thank We're so you guys. glad you're here. I'm excited about so, it. So okay, you can catch Unbreak My Heart when it premieres Saturday at 8 p.m. on Lifetime. Congratulations on Thank this. Thank you guys. Congrats. Yay. I'm proud of me. <laughs>